Welcome to the channel, my name is Finley and today it's my video. We're going to be riding around in the trenches in the offset, riding around our local neighbourhood. I hope you really uh, enjoy as this is going to be similar to our other videos, although it's just me. I hope you remember to like, subscribe and ring the bell. See you in the next one. For we local ride right now. I'm gonna go to the circle up here. I got swamp over here today. It's funny. Alright. Very muddy. Hopefully you could hear all the like squelching in the camera. But I'm basically sinking into the mud at this point. <laughs> I know this sounds a bit funny, but this is actually a pretty nice day. Although, the terrain is not the best city for what we're doing right now. Oh god. Right, here we go. Right, this is alright right now. I know the hell. As fast as I can ride in this mod. <laughs> Nothing too intense, just a bit of local neighbourhood riding. Here we go. Made it to the top. Now it's time for a descent, which I'm very scared for because it is very muddy. Right, here we go. Let's just send it! Woo! Whoa, it's very muddy! God, that's about the fifth time I've said that was video. But it definitely is. Whoa! Oh, this is like a bloody swamp. Guys, if you see this video, at least you know I'm alive. I don't know if I'm alive yet. Alright. Here we go, along this way we go. We bit of green light green lining. God, I can't even pronounce the words today. I'm gonna get slated in the comments, but oh well. Yeah. Round about winter time, let us uh, know what you're planning on doing for your holidays because obviously due to the pandemic we've not been able to get what done. We've just found out that we can have up to eight people from I think three households uh, at one time so we should be able to have an all right Christmas let me know what you guys are hoping for uh, you kids and for all you adults what are your kids asking for <laughs> do any of you want dirt bikes mountain bikes let us know and if you're situated like in Scotland area uh, or nearish to Falkirk Please let us know because we'll be happy to ride with you. As long as you're not some insane dirt jumper or you can only leave out because we're not really competent enough. <laughs> or if you are, you know, you can give us some tips. <laughs> yeah. So basically we've set up a few wee trails. Um, I guess we haven't set them up, but we found a few trails around our area. That's what I'm riding right now, one of them. Of these circuits. It's good. Um, we're just coming up to quite a muddy hill, maybe in like a minute or so, and I'll show you what I mean. My dad managed to get down uh, on the, on my mountain bike, which isn't really made for this type of stuff. Um, looking for Christmas, I happen to be asking for a mountain bike. I can get on the trails. But um, there's a hill coming up right here. But it's very, very muddy and slippy. It's so hard to get down, even on this. So it's not very good when your brakes aren't really working that well. Uh, 
is what suspension's for. <laughs> you guys might recognize this, but this is the wee muddy hill I'm talking about right now. Once we get up here, not too excited for. Whoa. Oh god. Whew. A bit scary, but we made it. This is very muddy, I'm having to put my foot down quite a lot. Wheels, not quite locking up, but it's definitely getting a bit tossed out. See, we're riding an offset um, on stuff that we should really be riding on, like, actual dirt bikes. But we don't really care. We have fun. You might recognise this one from our earlier videos. This is where I learned how to ride up hills. Doesn't look like much from here, but these were pretty hard when I was first learning. Now we can just go up and like this. Nice and easy. If you have a dirt bike or have uh, or want to get a dirt bike, please let us know in the comments uh, what you want or what you have and what age you were when you first started riding with us. Me, um, uh, I was 12. Um, I'm 13 now, um, and I'm never going back. Mm. Might try and wheelie that in a minute, actually. Whew. Well, bridge grained mouth, polluting the air. Don't know if you can see it very well in the video. I'll stop for a second so you can see. I've got my nicest view on the planet, but loads of trees and forestry all over there. Power lines. <laughs> yeah. Scotland can be very beautiful, but right now we're in like a wee town area. I'm going to loop around so I can get back onto another trail I felt like riding. Alright, wish me luck. I'm going for the wheelie. Whoa, we made it. And we're alive. Woohoo! If you haven't just skipped past the exciting parts of the video, put um, I'm here uh, in the comments and we'll give you a like, maybe even pin your comment. You know? Also, make sure to let us know what type of content you're looking for us to do with us. I mean, I know this is quite basic commentary stuff, but I mean, I enjoy it. My dad seems to enjoy watching back at it. Whoa. I don't really want to fall into that bit at the side, so I'm going to make sure to be nice and controlled. Oh, oh god! Whoa! Let us know what you guys like uh, writing in the comments as well. Jesus, I feel like I'm just asking for you to spam in the comments at this point. But do you ever like uh, muddy stuff or not muddy stuff? Oh, I don't think I've been up this one before. Let's see what it has to offer. Doesn't look like it's got much, but yeah, I'll give it a wee ride. See what's happening. So my dad happened to be looking uh, to get a KTM 350, like air spare edition or whatever. I don't really think he should, I think he should just get a normal 50 or like, even a 60, although it is still quite overpriced, it's better than spending thousands extra on some edition with just a few, a few graphics and, and yeah, apparently it's still quite a few and it's broken up and stuff, but it's not the same as just getting any old bike. That's a wee bunker. Whoa, that's kind of cool. I think it's probably just leading to the drains, but <laughs> what do I care? I think I may be leading myself into a swamp. This could be a bad idea. <sighs> Got myself in a bit of a sticky situation. <laughs> oh, 
guess you can see the, the vast swamp from here. Jeez. Oh god. I've really got myself in a sticky situation. I could try the turn thing where you go into a wheelie and turn it around, but I'm not very confident with that because I've never tried it. Oh god, I'm absolutely soaked. Alright, let me try and just get a blip. 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 Okay. God, I look so weak, don't I? Oh no. Alright. Thought I was gonna find a new wee trail over here, but nope, got myself stuck. This is what happens when you go solo riding. You go to places you normally wouldn't go to, and then get swamped. Alright. Here we go, I think I've got myself out. Right. Be watching this, please edit this part out. Hey. Got a feeling you're not gonna edit it out, but oh well. Alright, we back. We're alive. Time to go on an adventure. Alright, back this way we go. We're gonna get to that wee jump area we've been at a few times. It's quite good. If you want, next episode we'll see if we can get my dad to come out too on maybe the pit bike. We'll see if we can get to somewhere we can ride. Don't know for sure if that's going to be possible because obviously COVID pandemic can't really go very far. But um, actually we don't have a van either. Okay, scratch that. But I'm quite excited to get back out on my pit bike again. Get riding. Maybe we can go green lane at some point. When, when my dad gets his bike, we'll be able to go green lane and just go where the wind takes us. <laughs> There's another people up the hill. I'll see if I can just get past seven and go back down the hill. There we go. Oh, I think they want me to start wheeling. I'm going to go right past him. Not feeling it. I'm not warmed up enough to start wheeling. I know that's what Enduro kind of calls for, but hey, well, not trying to pop wheelies just to impress people. You don't get past the logs.
Oh god, this is like a trench again. I forgot about this part. No. Oh god. Let's see, I can go in this bit and maybe sleep there because there's not already any tracks. And I've made a mistake again. Oh god. The mud is taking over. Oh, crap. Alright, here we go. Back in action. Why'd you lift your base over here? Isn't that silly? Wait, really? Alright. I'll come back to you in a minute because we're about to go for the neighborhood. Don't want you guys having to look at registration plates and stuff. That's just more editing for my dad. Alright, see you in a minute.